to return things. And the spring season is underway at Delaware Stadium. Lee is under it, catches the football at the 15, gets to the 20, 25 yard line, 30, 35, makes a shift at the 40, sprinting sideline, 45, 30. Here he goes, Dejan Lee starting off the spring the right way, a touchdown, Blue Hens. How about Dejan Lee? Did a great job of puncturing initially, then a little hip move to the outside. Some great blocking by the kickoff. Time five, out of shotgun again is Fagiano. He'll keep this time. Pressure coming on the slant. Ball is caught for first down yardage at the 40, up to the 42 yard line. Down seven, nothing. Running wide. And they got nothing. A stop was made at midfield. Two in this contest against the main defense. And here's Lee shuffling his feet, patiently getting to the 35 yard line and down at the 36 on 36 yard line. And in motion goes Jordan Townsend. They'll give to Lee. He's got some room on the right side of the 40. Cuts at 45 near midfield. Another first down for Delaware. He Lee back is running back on fourth down and a yard in main territory at the 43-yard line. In motion goes Pitts. Give is to Lee. Lee gets the yard they needed plus a couple more. And that'll keep the drive going. Your center is Henderson. In motion goes Lee. It'll be Sproul this time. Plenty of room on the left side for first down yardage. Spinning, staying up, cutting at the 20. And in the red zone go the Hens for the first time today. Waiting. Nolan Henderson gets it. Pumping. Flush out of the pocket. Off his back foot throwing. Intercepted at the five-yard line. And the drive for Delaware. Now a return at the 40. Pitts is there to slow him down, spinning away from Pitts at the 50 to the 40-yard line. There was a flag on the return. I don't know if he'll get all that yardage, but unfortunately, after a 14-play, 67-yard drive by Delaware, it ends with an INT. From Williamsport, Pennsylvania, takes the snap. He's on the run. He's going to have to run for it. He does not get past Johnny Buchanan. It'll be fourth down for the Black Bears. Buchanan back as a defensive coordinator, and now here we go. Hens on offense operating as Nolan Henderson stays behind the line of scrimmage. Nice job of awareness where the line would be. Throws while on the run to Thyrick Pitts. Bank and Lee is still the running back. Dropping back, Henderson sets up the screen pass, dumps it off to Lee. Lee running at the 20, hit there, spinning, staying on his feet, diving for extra yardage to the 17. Motion goes Townsend behind Henderson. Henderson looking that way, checks off, being pressured, throws to Lee, somehow got it off, and he'll be tackled in the backfield. Nice job in space by Miles Taylor. Will snap it off, and trying to add to their lead. And Orion Co. does just that. 10 nothing is the Delaware lead over the main Black Bears with 10.45 remaining. Henderson to go under center, and the give is to Townsend to the outside, and it's going to be a race at the 45. 50 in the main territory at the 45 40 and knocked down at the 37 yard line. We see the speed of Jordan Townsend. Main says the ball came out. I think he was down. Coach at Garnet Valley. In motion goes Pitts. Hens need a yard. Henderson will give it to Sproul. Sproul, big opening up the middle. He gets more than the yard he was needed and gets to the 21 yard line. And he's available for Sproul and he is making the most of them. Henderson rolling out, looking at the end zone, has a man. It's Coleman. It's caught. It's a touchdown. Delaware up 16-0. Now a leader in that secondary. Third down and 10. Pressured is Fagiano. He dumps it off to his running back, but nowhere to go with it. No gain after three plays for Maine. And that time, it was Joe Zubalaga in the mix making the stop. In Maine territory at the 47, Dejan Lee looking for space. Bouncing to the outside on the right. Has first down yardage and more. Running sideline, 25-20. Knocked out of bounds. Hands back in the red zone. Henderson. Gets the football, and he'll keep it. Being pressured, nice job by Maine that time to not allow Henderson to get loose. A six-yard try on fourth down and nine. Kick is up, and that one's wide and to the right. So Delaware will go one of three. And they'll drop it to the man in motion. And he's going to be caught from behind, but was after five yards or six yards. They needed six. No pressure, a short punt. Towns are going to let that one, let the wind do its job and send that out of bounds in main territory. Third down in this one with a 17-0 lead. They'll give it to Lee. And Lee has enough. Gets inside the 30 and keeps the drive alive. 15 for Delaware in main territory. Henderson dropping back. Has some time in the pocket. No one's open. He's going to run it. 
tucks and nowhere to go at for Ryan Coe on fourth down and 11. Kick is up, certainly has the distance. And it's on target. Ryan Coe makes his second field goal of the game. Early movement. So it'll be third down and nine after the five-yard penalty. Henderson stands, fires, throws, caught. Zimmerman should have enough. Should be right at the stick. Sproul to his right. Gets the snap. Good blocking by the Delaware offensive line. Throws, finds Zimmerman again, and he's got his second straight third down conversion. Dylan Zimmerman was open right in the middle of the field. Take it down. Paoletti will keep it again, this time to the right side. Jumps over a main defender, Anthony Paoletti, with the athleticism. As Delaware's offense in the red zone, what a play by Anthony Paoletti. It's Townsend. Give is to Lee, up the middle, burst of speed. He won't be stopped until he reaches the end zone. The second touchdown of the day for Dejon Lee. Carter Lynch threw a great play. Delaware was on fourth down and one. First time going for it on fourth down for Maine. Some trickery, ball comes loose. Andre Miller picks it up back at the 30. He might be able to run for it though. He will at midfield at the 40, brought down at the 35 yard line. And somehow, some way, Maine able to turn what looked like a fumble that could have been recovered by Delaware into a big first down pickup. How many times do you see that happen, Scott, where you have this big play, it looks like it's going to go against the team, and they pick it up. The defense overran that. Uh, Palmer did a nice job of getting in the backfield to break that up. We can get the official to get his the mic The ball back. was fumbled by number one, recovered by number 10 and advanced. By rule on fourth down, it is a dead ball if, if the fumbler is not the one to advance. It'll be first down Delaware at the spot of the recovery. First down. That's huge for many reasons. Obviously, now it's Delaware football, but down though. And now it's Henderson. It'll be Sproul again. He'll get enough to the 24 yard line. Back to back carries by Corey Sproul. Good enough for 11. To 65. That's the total yards in this game. An advantage of Delaware. Henderson on third down and seven from midfield. Ball is tapped in the air and going to be intercepted by Ori Gene Charles. Gene Coleman signaling that Gene Charles dropped the football. It was tipped. Ori Gene Charles had the football and started to run with it. And they're going to say that it was bobbled and dropped. Button unit on. First punt of the day. Nearly blocked by off the leg of Pistula. Now it's touched by Miller. And Delaware racing for the football. Ball is loose near the end zone. Delaware recovers at the one. Don't know why Miller was even jumping for that ball. There's no reason to try to jump and touch the football. He did, and then running down to the one-yard line for the Delaware special teams players, and they got their first. Special teams play. Henderson sends Lee in motion. Will keep it himself. And the extra push gets him in. Delaware dominated. Something he will be able to tell his children. He's got a couple now, and he was the football coach at Tattnall for a few years and is now uh, working in private industry. Third down and 10, an eight-yard run by Maine's Tavion Banks, his first carry for the true freshman. Not going to be enough to get the uh, first down. Being very uh, circumspect and making his decisions and being able to catch the ball. Great point there, Gwynn. Throws it into a little bit of uh, traffic for, for Towns third down in quite some time. One of 12 goes main. And there you go. They converted on a third down that time around. Of the, uh, or so after. High snap on fourth down. Screen pass is caught. Move is made. And they're going to be a yard shy of the marker. What a tackle in space by Tyler Boyd. In their favorite formation, the victory formation. Take the knee, and the spring season starts with a victory for the Delaware Blue Hens. A 37-0 dominating win by the Hens over the Maine Black Bears.